Just bow bow on tour. Kabing init dito guys. Woohoo! Sobrang init. Uma apoy. Uma apoy ngayon naglilab ang ating mga pairs, mga heat pairs ng Travis Scott sneakers. Guys, these are the best of the best Travis Scott sneakers. At syempre, may nadagdag. Guys, may nadagdag sa pamilya. Cactus Jack 270 React. Fresh from the mailbox, guys. Ito, i-review natin ito ngayon, no? Pero, bago yan, don't forget to subscribe to this channel. Hit that notification bell. And follow me on Instagram at Julius Baba. Okay, here we go. Travis, no? Uh, Astro World Basketball from Seoul Republic. Shout out to Lerwin Yap at Satropa ng Seoul Republic. Also, I was able to get this pair from Seoul Republic. Ayan. Thank you guys. Thank you. Okay, bago natin i-review. Yung Travis Scott 270. Papakita ko muna yung ilan sa mga favorite pairs of sneakers ng Travis Scott ko sa aking collection. Sobrang init nito guys, no? Kayo ba? Meron ba kayong mga favorite na mga sneakers ni Travis Scott? Ako, medyo naguguluhan ako, no? Kasi pag tinitingnan ko lahat ng kanya mga sneakers, halos lahat talaga guys. Favorite ko eh. Ang hirap pumili. So, kayo guys, ano ba ang favorite na, ano, na sneakers nyo? Sa akin, ang pinaka-favorite ko talaga is yung Jordan 1. Okay? The Jordan 1 sa tingin ko, ito na yung pinaka-sneakers na magde-define kay Travis Scott as a sneaker designer. Basically because it's kind of simple. Pag tinignan mo yung color na ginamit na, yung color palettes na, brown, a little bit of uh, gray and white and black. Hindi siya masyadong... Lumayo doon sa design ng Jordan 1s. Uh, of course, he used different materials doon sa, sa ginamit niya mga overlays. It's a uh, new book material. Tapos yung swoosh niya, uh, ni-reverse niya to make it unique. And of course, yung kanyang pocket. No? Yung sash pocket dito sa side. That's the one that made uh, a difference. If you're given a chance to collect Travis Scott sneakers na isa lang, I would invest on these sneakers kasi tingin ko tataas pa ang value nitong sneakers na ito compared to the other Travis Scott's. And second sa mga favorite ko is the Jordan 6. Definitely. Ito yun. Uh, medyo uh, may similarity siya sa Jordan 1 uh, because it's high and uh, surprisingly it's comfortable to wear. Uh, ilang beses ko na itong nasuot and uh, I enjoy wearing it. Tapos meron din siyang uh, pocket doon sa side that uh, makes it unique. And of course, ang daming mga details pero hindi siya masyadong parang sumisigaw, no? Hindi masyadong uh, uh, nag-overdesign si Travis. And siguro ang third ko is the Dunk. Undeniably good-looking sneakers. Medyo na doon siya sa over-over na design. But uh, for me, it still works kahit na sobra-sobra ang details, of course. Mas mataas pa rin yung, yung Jordan 4 na, na purple ni Travis kasi for friends and family lang yun. And the last time I checked, that's about 25,000 US dollars. So, 25 times 5, no? 1 million plus. 1 million uh, pesos. So now, without further ado, let's go to the most uh, hype sneakers of uh, 2020 na inabutan na ng pandemic. <laughs> inabutan ng pandemic. Pero still, kahit na may pandemic, hype na hype pa rin siya at pinag-uusapan pa rin siya. Ito na po yung uh, Cactus Jack Nike React Air Max 270. from Seoul Republic. Ito na yun guys, no? Let's check out the details of the Cactus Trail. The first thing I notice about these sneakers is the midsole. I see an oversized air bubble unit on the midsole that extends from the side up to the other side. So, pag tingin mo pa lang sa sneakers na ito, parang ang feeling mo, 
para napaka comfortable niya o kasi sa laki ng air unit dun sa midsole aside from the air unit we also see patterns na parang waves dito sa uppers ng sneakers yan uh, it's uh, made of uh, TPU material yung mga grooves na yan that extends from the front uh, to the side and up to the back of the sneakers on the toe box we see a nubok material that's colored uh, hazel and on the side there's a nike logo stitched on the edge of the toe box colored silver pag minumove mo yung sneakers na to uh, depends on the light you will see the effect of the grooves or the waves on the upper of the sneakers na para siyang uh, nagbabago depending on the lighting and on the middle part of the sneakers there is also a nubuk material used dito sa may um, eye ring niya uh, I see red na eyelets and then uh, yung kanyang uh, laces para nagperform siya in a uniform way that goes into a loop dun sa pinaka gitna ng uh, lace And made of uh, neoprene tongue. material. Ito yung mga ginagamit yata ng mga diver para mas naka-fit yung sneaker sa paa mo. Pag suot-suot mo kasi may pagka-stretchable siya. And again, on the top of the lace, uh, he used the, the plastic lock which he also used in the Jordan 6. Uh, it's colored uh, blue and uh, purple with uh, Nike's Whoosh logo. Actually, it's more of uh, design na lang. Wala siya masyadong purpose. And at the back of the sneakers, you will see the Cactus Jack logo printed on the heel tab. Inside, uh, we see another kind of material na parang uh, ginagamit din sa mga sports outfit. Doon sa pinaka insole, you'll see the Ugly Face logo. Pinanitan niya yung uh, nakastitched na mouth nitong uh, caricature and he put a Nike Air Swoosh on the mouth of the cartoon and on the other pair naman you see the cactus jack logo there he used a uh, different kind of uh, uh, material dito sa bandang uh, ankle part ng uh, sneakers um, it's made of fleece no ito yung ginagamit sa mga jacket i think it adds a little bit of comfort dun sa ankle part ng sneakers and there's a nike logo stitched on the side uh, na colored orange. It's made of uh, very light materials. Doon pa lang sa pinaka midsole niya, alam mo na na parang foam lang eh, yung ginamit na, na material dito. Kaya very light lang siya. And under the sneakers, you will see uh, different kinds of uh, patterns. Yan. And nandiyan pa rin yung uh, faded uh, gold na paint na ginamit niya sa rest ng uh, midsole ng sneakers. So there you go guys, that is the Cactus Trail the Air Max 270 React Sneakers by Travis Scott. Hey you guys, ano yung pinaka favorite nyo na Travis Scott sneakers? So let me know in the comments below. Guys, nung sa previous vlog natin, pinakita ko sa inyo yung 9 bot scooter na mas uh, magaan. This time, I'm going to show you the Max version, which is the uh, upgraded version nitong scooter na ito na pwede mong gamitin sa labas ng bahay, even sa mga highway, pwede mong gamitin doon sa side, no? Uh, pwede mong gamitin sa mga park, sa kakait na uphill, malakas pa rin yung power nito. So, I was able to borrow a unit from sneakers and such at style, so check out my review of this scooter. This time, tatry naman natin yung pinaka-powerful na scooter. So, ito guys, ang uh, kick scooter by 9Bot. Start muna natin. Ayan. Pupush natin. Ayan. Ito yung pinaka-acceleration. Ito yung brake. So, try natin kung uh, gano'ng kalakas ito. So, I made sure na naka-helmet ako, guys. No? Pagkagamit kayo ng ganito, kinakailangan naka-helmet. And huwag pala kakalimutan yung face mask. Okay? Let's try na natin. Let's go. 
go downhill. Alalay lang tayo sa Pero, okay? Pagpababa na delikado kasi So, aalalayan mo yung brakes niya Yung handbrake Alay lang Pwede mag mo na pindutin yung Acceleration pag downhill Kasi talaga pababa naman siya Para makasave ka rin ng battery And then, pag malapit ka na sa baba, push natin uling ganyan. Ayan. Medyo, oh yan, rough road na tayo. Kaya medyo, ano, malagtag. Malalay lang sa humps. Ayan, reno. Yun, okay. Malakas na may power niya eh, oh. oh. Kahit na malubak, okay lang siya. Dito medyo tutuloy na natin. Kasi, dire-diretso lang itong kalsada. Ayan, 22. 23 24 yeah. km per hour Medyo matulid tayo dito kasi wala mga sagabal wala mga camps Dito sa part na to, medyo yan, medyo steep na talaga yung kalsada So let's try kung kakayanin ng power nitong scooters yung sobrang tarik ng paakyat Okay, well, well muna tayo ng konti Full power tayo Naka full power tayo, eto, taas na nito guys, patarik na to Ayan, nakita nyo Tignan natin kung kaya niya, kakayanin pa Sige, well sa pa Medyo hirap Medyo hirap Medyo hirap pero kaya Kaya, kaya guys Wow Nakayanan, ang galing Ayos ha Ang tarik na nung daan na yun pero kinaya pa rin yun So yun guys, yung scooter na yan uh, is available for order at Sneakers and Such at Style. It is located at the mid-level of the East Wing of Shangri-La Plaza Mall in Etsa, Mandaluyong. And also take advantage of the sale that's going on sa mga Jordan 1s sa S&S. Again, the question is, what is your favorite Travis Scott sneakers? Yeah. I-post nyo lang ang comments nyo below and tell us why. Alright? Bye guys, see you! Don't forget to subscribe to this channel, like our videos, and post your comments below. And always hit the notification bell.